going to show you how to put on your breath wand. See, I've already done this hand, so I wanted to go ahead and show you how to do your other hand. Well, you know, put them on either way. So, I have already prearranged how I want them set out. This is again going to be for my right hand. You are going to take your file and remove the shine off of your natural nail. Just like so. You want to make sure that you push your cuticles back as well. So I've pretty already done that. I'll push my cuticles back. Um, now I'm just going to remove the shine. Making sure that this is prepped and ready to go. So you might find it a little difficult, but it can be done. If you need help, I would advise you to get help from someone that you um, know will not mind. But if not, it's cool too. Because it can be done. May feel a little awkward though, you know? Alright, so once you got the shine removed off of all 10 nails, you want to make sure that, um, take care of your free edge, go around the free edge of the nail, just kind of smooth it all out. Um, if you already have nails, you know, I recommend that you cut them down just a little bit, um, just to like an active length, so that your press-ons are not distorted because of the shape of your nail already growing out. Being that I don't have anything, like, my nails will be the actual press-ons, so it just makes it a lot easier. Okay guys, so moving forward, from your kit, you're going to get one of your wipes, and we're going to open that bad boy up, go and dig in there and get that out, make sure you clean your nails thoroughly, leaving no dust residues around. Not only is this dehydrating your nail bed, but it's cleansing it as well, and cleanliness is what we need in this time of crisis. So, make sure that you are definitely cleaning your nails. Mm -hmm. Alright, all clean. My nails look terrible. I'm sorry, guys. I bite my nails. It's a bad habit. Don't recommend it. Nobody think. Get it? <laughs> Alright, so we're going to take our tip. We got our nails cleaned off, prepped and ready to go. So, then you take your glue. I like to put it in the well of the tip. Well, I'm probably going to do that second because I also like to put it on the nail itself. Okay, this one, this side is going to be a little bit more difficult. A little goes a long way, guys. Sorry for my shaking. This is not easy. Mm, yeah, that's not easy at all. You kind of want to move fast because this glue will dry on you and you don't want that. But you're going to Lay it down right in front of the cuticle, kind of push back. Don't get it on the cuticle. I do like a little rocking back back and forth motion, and I press down to relieve any air sockets, any air bubbles, and then you just hold it. So I like to blow on it, try to remove some of the um, dry time. If you have excess on the side, just kind of push down, like rub it down. Um, I got an air pocket in here. I'm going to try to get rid of that. But for the most part, it is on there. Yeah. See? And that's that. Boom, bam. You got a nail on. And then you're going to move to your next one. Be sure not to get it on your cuticles. Uh, I slightly got this on mine a little bit. Not a whole lot. Hot water will release that. Um... So, yeah, try not to be in hot water within the first couple of hours of putting this on, um, as that can kind of make the nail come back off. You don't want that. Once it seals and it dries completely, you're good to go. Because, like, sis, these are on. Like, they ain't going nowhere, okay? Oh, and I've, I've pre-drilled these because I'm going to prep them for work. So, I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but... Yeah, nails. Alright, sorry, moving along. And get your other hand. I mean your other nail getting going. And you're gonna put a little bit of glue on here. Boom boom boom. You're gonna take your tip, put a little glue in there. 
Boom, 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 boom. Set that down. Again, you're going to get close to the cuticle, but not up on it. Press down, let that glue shimmy around in there. And then you're going to put that tip on. And then I just like to press on it. Hold it for a few seconds. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to wiggle back and forth just a little bit. You're not wiggling the tip. You're just wiggling your nail. Or, excuse me, your finger. Because you want to make sure that this is on in, in all angles. So, you just analyze it real quick. See if it's on straight and everything like that. Make sure none of the skin is getting up under it. And then I just like to press down one more time because I like to ensure quality at all times and make sure that my nails are on and that they are fully sealed. And then that's that. All right, get your next tip ready. Put the glue down. Yep. I might have put a little bit too much glue on this one, so I don't need none of my tips. If you come into this problem, take a cotton. No, you know what? Yeah, no, I'm going to use it. Just be mindful that you do have glue that shifted over there. And just let it fill up the well of your tip. Just like that. I don't have any air pockets, so that actually worked out perfectly. Now that worked out real perfectly. I do have a little built up on the side, but I can easily get that off. Um, if you take a Q-tip and dip it in some acetone, be very careful of your actual nail, the press on. Um, or you can just wait until everything is fully dry when you take a shower or your bath. Uh, more than likely the glue will come off in the shower um, because it's on the skin. And anything else is, is already sealed in between. So, you know, you're pretty much good on that. Look at that. On there. On there, honey. Honey, look. Ooh, I'm excited about my nails, y'all. I haven't had nails in a while. I tried to do this video the other day for you all, but uh, I couldn't function with the nails. They were too long. <laughs> so I had to take them off. I was like, I got work to do. I need I need to be able to get work done. So, oh, I got a boo-boo. I hurt my hand over here. It's okay. So then I take this tip. And then we just gonna press that in. Mm -hmm. Like so, like that. <laughs> Y'all follow Miss Tabitha Brown. She is amazing. Like I love her. Um, she always got something motivational to say, and her food would be looking amazing. Make me want to go vegan. But yeah, got the tip on. Press out any excess glue. I'm going to blow on it just a little bit, let that glue dry a little bit faster. Wipe off the excess. I like to wipe down. That's my business. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wipe all that off. I got a boo-boo, guys. I just did that though. I was I was doing stuff with my drill before I got started. Cause my cuticles look horrendous, and I was trying to make them look a little bit better. All right, so that's on. It's on. It's last finger, and I'm excited. Ah! Put it in the well of your tip, or you can put it on the actual um, fingernail, whichever works best for you. You do both, just don't use a lot. Slide it up to the nail. If you catch an air bubble, try to catch it before you press down. Once you got it where you like it, press down, hold for a few seconds. This will allow the glue in your nail to have a bond. And then, boom, bam, bam, you got press bonds, boo. Look at that. Press it on one more time, rock it back and forth. I like to make sure, you don't have to do this, I just like to make sure because I want my nails to last and I don't want them to come off. So I like perfection at all times. And then look, I don't want to hit that one yet because it's still dry. I mean, but it's honey. She good, she good, she good. Uh, uh. Look y'all, I got nails. Yeah. 
So I'm going to go ahead and shape this hand because I didn't pre-shape mine before I started. Look at all that glue I got stuck on me. But I didn't shape mine before I actually um, showed y'all this. I was just trying to get you guys a video going. So, boom. That's my nails. And I love them. I love this shape, actually. I really love this shape. This is what the finished shape will look like when I'm done. So, if you don't already have this shape and you're interested, get at me. You know how to get your nails. Thanks, guys. I appreciate y'all so much. And I hope that this video helped. I'll talk to you later. Thank you for buying from Empress on Nails and Nail Biter Zines. Bye, guys.